My journey for smallmouth begins down by St. Louis, Missouri. This area has many wide ranging attractions. The home of the St. Louis Cardinals, caverns from Six Flags to the zoo. But I am traveling down to this part for a different matter entirely. Smallmouth bass. My good friend Christian Clare, aka Midwest Dingfest, invited me down here to try to put me on my very first smallmouth. So the family and I packed up and drove down to St. Louis. We checked in our hotel right outside of the head carriage rides. So we all hopped on board and we took a tour of downtown St. Louis. The carriage rides were so nice. Nice view of downtown St. Louis where we stayed. Everyone we encountered was friendly and welcoming. Oh, I was like, where does Hank go? <laughs> St. Louis has a very vibrant nightlife. The city almost seems to come alive. We had an amazing view from the rooftop of our hotel. There is still hope in this world. One man, one mission, to finally catch a smallmouth. What up? Get in, loser, we're going <laughs> fishing. Oh yeah. It was a restless night with the traffic on the highway and then the excitement of going to fish a new spot. So we embark on our journey. The first spot wasn't producing like Christian thought it would. And you could tell it was getting to him. But that's okay. That's why they call it fishing and not catching. I was having an off morning myself. I kept getting snags. I lost my little oh, backup man. creek pole. Man, I lost my little pole. There she be. I always wanted to bring a video camera down here or take video of catching fish. Finally get a camera down here and I'm not catching anything. Bringing Nate all the way down to St. Louis. Can't even catch him a smallmouth. Kind of makes me look like a jerk. One thing I've learned with fishing, perseverance and consistency really pays off. Largy? Nice. So we stuck with it and we kept grinding. After a short drive, we arrive at the next spot. It seems more promising. We're still in high hopes. We start having some fun. Yeah. 
Little ankle biters over here. They're going after it though. I got Fleetwood Max stuck in my head. Go back to the gypsy that <laughs> oh, I had a little, little nibbly. Give me some nibble, 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 nibble. I had a hamster named Nibbles. I cried for three days after dad. These little guys are chasing it, but they're just not big enough. She got stuck in your head. Running in the shadows, oh, keep us together. Oh, that's a nice little deep spot right here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah man. man, there we go. Oh, hold your horses. Come on, fella. Dude. He got some spunk. Large mouth. Nice. He got some spunk. Hey, I broke the ice. Well, I'm going to go ahead and say that like a T Rex or something clawed this years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, there's a splash underneath the bridge. You see it? I might get up on the rocks and sneak up there. Got him right out of that hole right there. Let's see if we can catch another one. Get a shot of my lure coming by. How was that? Some tactical bass right now. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Man, that's beautiful, dude. Look at that. Beautiful. <laughs> Small mouth. She's swimming right there. It's a tiny one. Oh, wow. You got it like right on him. Oh, he was following it. He's still around here, but he's not biting. That, that is a small mouth. Oh, he went way too far. He went way far. He's all the way into the brush pile now. And keep us together. Oh. It's your lucky day, pal. And I lost it. We're not catching nothing, so I don't want to waste too much more time here. We were about to leave when all of a sudden the unexpected happened. Whatever's hanging, you see that thing hanging over here? Whatever it is, it's big. I kept noticing something. It was twitching and it's a little bit. Caught on some fishing braid. Oh, he's yep. breathing hard. We're gonna try to get him, get him unhooked. See, that's what he kept doing. Oh, wow. Here, yeah, let's clip him over here and get him down. Like he's trying to chew, chew through it now. Okay, buddy. Hey, 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 it's okay. It's okay. You're gonna die if you don't get help. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, man. Try not to, but he's attacking too, yeah. Come on. 
course those would be crappy cut and scissors. Man, I'm sorry guy, I don't know what to do. Me either. You ain't got a towel in your bag, do you? Nope. At this point, we don't know what Here. to do. I look over and there's towels from some kids swimming. I'm gonna just pick him up. The easiest way to catch a bat anyway is to get one in your house. All right, buddy. Okay. Oh, good call, man. <laughs> he sketches me out every time. Such a harmless creature. Hey, buddy. You almost got it, dude. You're doing a killer job, man. I wish we had my scalpel. scissors. Scalpel. Yeah. Oh, buddy. I know, bud. There you go. I hope you survive. With this spot being muddy, we were at odds. We spent more time trying to get the truck unstuck than we did fishing this spot. Did they get washed down? They just weren't biting. Get one? Largy? It's a little after mid-afternoon. We decide we're gonna go to this place. This was a long drive. This was almost all the way down to Cape Girardeau, Missouri. By now, Christian is pretty frustrated as he notices that the water is low. We've been to many spots and just haven't produced a smallmouth yet. Oh, something's down there. Get one? Yep, it's just one. Oh. Okay, come over here. You go and totally redeem yourself. <laughs> right underneath there. There he is. Oh, oh, oh. I saw him hit it. Do it again. Okay. Well, this way is where we normally go. If you want to head that way. <sighs> Whoa, dude, there is something big over there. I ain't even playing. Yes. I just seen white. Do you? This whole brown eye. <laughs> yes. It's been caught before, look at his nose. Yeah, old Smalley. Sure. That must have been the good flash I've seen. Must have. Whoa, he went all the way back there. Hey, he's right under that tree over there. Oh, got one. That's another Smalley. With Christian being the only one that's catching smallmouth, I need to step up my game. Midwest Dink Test. The dinkiest dink. The, the dinkiest dink. There you go. <laughs> I'm not trying, man. Maybe I'm trying too hard. I keep seeing that top water over here. I'm going to bomb it. Right there. All those miles driven, no sleep last night. After wading in the creeks with daylight running out, we're both exhausted. My GoPro batteries go to die right at a critical point.
My very first smallmouth. Look at this beautiful guy. Look at great belly, man. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Look at that. That's so that they can fight in the current, man. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Yeah, absolutely. Put dude. me on some small mouth. I'm we happy. did it. We did it. Finally. Get a release on this guy, and then I'm going back for more because I think they're right here. Ooh, large mouth. <laughs> he swam out from underneath a rock and got it. Nate, right there. Big small mouth, right there. Yep, just reel it back. Perfect. Oh, no, he went after it, dude. He went after it. Go back, go back. He's right there. He's nosed in on it right now, man. Yeah. Ah. Now they're smally. Right. Oh, man, he went after it like three times. Oh, you bit the tail off. Oh, man. Okay, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh my goodness. That's another smallmouth. They bite so awesome. Yes. Nice You're job, man. <laughs> <laughs> These guys got a whole different attitude. Yep. That is the truth. Mm-hmm. All right. Another smallie. These smallmouth. Bite like a large mouth twice its size. I love it. But as soon as he gets home, he's bam. Bite. <laughs> <laughs> just me on. I'm out. <laughs> Man, that's so awesome. I'm really, I'm really glad you're you're catching them now. He's like. They're so mean. <laughs> Ooh, fish on. Oh, it came off. I had my drag set pretty loose too, so. Just hold on, please. Yes. Nope. Just fight. Oh. How is this happening? Dude. Yep, you got him. You got him. Now that I caught my first few smallmouth, it's given me confidence to catch more and to come back swinging. Yeah, yeah. We unlocked the smallmouth. Give me a little Boy Scout bag. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. It's kind of hard to tell the size of them because they fight so hard you think it's big. Right. Got one. Ooh, I got him side hooked. Quick release. With all the obstacles we faced, just when it looked like all was lost, we managed to pull it off. I had a great trip, great day with a friend. Until next time, this is Chasing Smallies.